Hi folks, today I'm going to be reviewing the Wet n Wild Cream Eyeliner in Black, and this is what it looks like. Um, it was $3.99, and I was only able to find it at Walgreens. Um, now, this is something I would definitely, definitely recommend because it lasts forever. Like, when I tried it on um, the first day, and... It lasted all day and I actually fell asleep with it on and the next day like it was still on like and didn't fade or anything which is really good because I kind of just wanted to test out like its longevity and everything so this it lasts forever it's really creamy it applies easily I can I even will use this like on my actual waterline and put it on there um and it works great um and I believe this is one of the cheapest ones you can find. So I would really definitely recommend getting this. There's also one by Jane that my mom bought. Um, which if you don't have your own set of brushes and you're just going to rely on the brush that these come with. I might recommend getting the Jane product. Because it comes with a much softer brush. The brush that came with this um, was thick. And it was like I tried to put it on and it was really rough and actually hurt my eyelids so I just use my own brush that's soft so I wouldn't recommend to use the brush that comes with the wet and wild but like I said my mom got the Jane one which was like um a dollar fifty more or something like that but the brush um, it looks and feels a lot softer so I would definitely recommend you go get this product if you're looking for a nice cream or gel eyeliner to try out because it is cheap and it does last. Also wanted to review you guys on the LA Colors uh, Eye Palette in Supernatural. And you get 12 eyeshadows with this. I really was interested in these last four colors, the grays and the black. Um, that's why I bought it. It was only a dollar. So I'll show you the swatches here. Some of them are pigmented and some of them you can't even see. So we'll show you here. So this is what they look like. This, the row on the bottom here is actually the top row, and the row on the top is the bottom row. Um, as you can see, there's some pigmented colors, and like the other colors that are right here, you can't even see them. And the ones that are in the middle there, you can't see them. So like the light colors are really, really light. So you can only really get use out of the, you know, more pigmented ones if you're looking for a strong look. Now, um... I wanted to just do a smoky look with the grays and the black, but when I tried to do the smoky look with this, it turned out blue. And um, the grays, which you can't really tell, but when you put it on your eye, those last four grays there, they have blue in them, even though it doesn't look like they do. So when you do a smoky eye with this, it looks like a bluey black. So, if that's something that you're looking for. Um, I like the palette the way it looks. It looks very cute. Um, I really don't wear blue, but I, I really wanted to get it because of the last four colors there to do a little smoky look since it was only a dollar. But, um, and just to have blue if I ever needed it. So, if you're looking to do a blue look with this... I would get it, um, but beware that the dark grays and blues down here are the dark grays and blacks. I mean, it there's blue in them, so it's all going to be very blue. So if you're looking for something blue, <laughs> then there you have it. They are pretty pigmented. This is all just kind of like one swipe. But that's pretty much my overall review um, with the Supernatural palette. So, it's only a dollar. Uh, if you're looking for blue, go check it out. And if you're looking for a cream liner, definitely check out the Wet n Wild for $3.99 because it's awesome. It lasts forever. It glides on. It's awesome. Alright, guys. That's it. I'll see you guys later if you have any um, comments or questions. Please write them in the comment bar and let me know if you want any specific tutorials or reviews or anything like that. Alright guys, see y'all later. Bye.